Hi, my name is Jordan Lemley, and I'm an applications engineer with Hawkridge Systems. And today we're going to be talking about the new automated cache management options in EPDM. So new in 2014, EPDM 2014, are options for dealing with the user's local cache in an automated way. So previously, in other versions of EPDM before 2014, if you wanted to clear your local cache and remove the, the local files from your user's local cache, you would have to do that manually, either by selecting on the file, going to Tools, Clear Local Cache, or selecting the entire folder and going to Tools and Clear Local Cache. And that would clear those local files from the user's cache. Now, in 2014, we have new options for dealing with that uh, local cache. So if I go to the user's options, you'll see that there's a new option called Cache Options. If I select that, there's the ability down in the bottom to choose between clear cache during logout or refresh cache during login. So clear cache during logout will allow me to clear all the local copies of files in a certain directory that I've specified. So for example, I can make that the whole vault or just a particular folder inside the vault. So for example, perhaps this grill assembly. And so I can test that real quick. Go ahead and confirm it. And let me go ahead and get all the local versions here. So you can see I have all of the local versions and once I've logged out, it will clear the cache for me without me having to do anything. So you see, just by logging out, I was able to clear my local cache. And the same thing applies for get latest version. So for example, under cache options, I also have the ability to choose refresh cache during login. And what this does is copy the latest version of all of those files to my local cache. So this might be useful, for instance, for a shared library or toolbox where you've you need to always have the latest version of those files, but you don't want to manually update that every single time. You just want the users to always have the latest version local in their cache. You could specify that that directory has this option selected refresh cache during login. So we'll go ahead and test that out as well. Refresh cache during login. So what I'll do here is get a previous version of this assembly. We'll do get version 1. And so I'm sitting with version 1. So because I have refresh cache during login, that means all of these uh, files that are missing versions will be updated. And this assembly that's referencing version 1 will get updated to version 2 just by me logging in. So we'll go ahead and try that out. navigate to our directory. And so if I take a look at this assembly, we'll see that it automatically grabbed the next version and grabbed any files that didn't exist in my local cache automatically. So that's a pretty useful feature if you wanted to kind of create some automation around your local cache. So in today's video, we covered how to clear local cache and get the latest version of files in a local directory using EPDM's uh, new version 2014 automated cache management. Thanks for watching.